Which word again can I use? To plead. Another word? To encourage. Another word? To what? I beg. Amen. I love that because we are smiling. The church has a program which has been put in place for our spiritual growth. Second Timothy 2.15 says we should study. But if you look at the other part, rightly dividing the word of God. What does it mean? What do you understand by that? How do you rightly divide the word of God? It means the, also means the application of the word. Be a Christian is not, it is not, I can, it's a way of life. What, you, what we learn in the scripture are the things we should apply to our life on day-to-day -day basis. You can read the Bible. You can be a professor of the scripture. They will also know the Bible. But what makes a difference? The application of that word. Abi? Devil could tell for Jesus. So, the application of the word is very important. How do we get this done? I said, just a program. We call it here money due. Who understand money due? How many of us know what to mean by money due? Apart from few people. Who doesn't know what to mean by money due, please? Just do like this. Money due. I could see some hands. God bless you. Or who knows Sunday school? It means most of us are not correct. Praise the Lord. So we are talking of what? Sunday school. But it's called money due now. I plead, as I said earlier, let's make it a point of duty from today on to be part and parcel of Sunday school. I beg you. I've not seen anybody when pastor is preaching here and say, pastor, that thing you said, I do not believe you. I don't believe, I heard you, but no, I don't believe that. How many of us have, have done that before? Nobody. But when the, we gather together to study in, on Monday due every Sunday, in fact, we will see people discussing their understanding of some things, and we all learn from that. Praise the Lord. This morning we watched a clip from a man of God. He read, I think, Matthew 5. Let me pick 14. He said, you are the sort of the world. When he was analyzing it, he said, you need to contribute. You need to impact life. I want everybody to make it a point of duty from today. It started from Sunday to be impactful in Sunday school. Come and contribute. We want to learn from you. We want to hear from you. And God will give us the grace to do that in the mighty name of Jesus. So I'm pleading, please. Your Sunday service, it is not complete with that word, money due. Please and please and please. By the mercies of God, starting next Sunday, let's be here at least 9 o'clock. We start 9 o'clock to enjoy the blessings that is what? All loaded in Sunday school. And God will give all the grace to do that in the mighty name of Jesus. So how many of us will be here on Sunday? How many? 9 a.m. I don't want to see that. It doesn't say it belongs. It's only pastor that goes. That is for pastors. No, it's for everyone. Please. Let's try to be available every Sunday. And God bless you. <laughs>